Player of the Month, Shohei Otani, is finally home. And today is going to be his big debut. The problem is, I have a terrible team around him. Luckily, though, we're going to be spinning from this wheel to get his teammates. And we have insane amounts of stuff on this wheel. So let's go ahead and get the first spin underway. And we're starting off freaking great, dude. Market page 12, which actually is not that bad considering a lot of the other stuff we have on this wheel. But with market page 12, well, it's pretty simple. I got to go over to the page 12 of the market. And a lot of the guys here aren't bad, but it's not exactly what I'm looking for with Shohei Otani being my guy, but I'm sure we'll find somebody okay. And since there's 15 different players on this page, we're going to go ahead and let Google decide. So random number generator 1 to 15, we got 14. So John, welcome to the team, dude. We also have a max of 15 spins on the wheel. After the 15 spins, hopefully we have a fantastic team going into our ranked seasons game. And if we lose that game, a random player from this team will get discarded. I would rather if that didn't happen. So wheel, give me something good for the second spin random bronze oh my god and with the bronze i think michael Kopik is probably going to be the guy that we add spin number three baby i need something big i need our first good pull right here and there it is fifty thousand subs meaning i got fifty thousand subs in the bank right now to be able to get whatever player i want and yo i'm feeling that we need an outfielder so real quick let me set the limit hey i gotta go with this one i know we can spend up to fifty thousand, and i feel kind of bad not hitting that fifty thousand mark but jock peterson he's looking like a fantastic addition to this team the only problem is do i try to go for someone just a little bit more expensive like this Justin Morneau and just hope that the wheel will come back around to maybe 25000 or something like that so we'll be able to get someone like Jack Peterson. I think the best way of going about this is just me getting the player that I want and honestly I want Jack Peterson. I love the guy's swing. He's insanely powerful so I'm going with Jack and Jack welcome to the squad. I know it's kind of anticlimactic. I had 50000 to spend and I spent less than twenty, but it's definitely worth it. Spin four. We're coming off a really good one. 10 pack bundle. All right I'm down for that. I don't think I really have to explain it but just in case if we're basically going to be opening up 10 packs and whatever card I get that's the best out of these 10 packs, I'm going to be putting on the team. So let's just hope I get something good. And so far, it's been Bronze City. Please don't let this happen to me. Like, yo, at least show me a silver or something or a gold. I'll be fine with that. I don't need a diamond out of these 10 packs. I really don't. And it is going really bad right now. Yo, a full bronze pack. Oh, gosh. No, dude, please. Three more packs to go. Come on. Still bronzes. Guys, stop it. We got our first silver with two packs left. And it's going to be Tanner Scott. Yo, Tanner, you might be it dude one more pack right here don't tell me don't tell me don't tell oh my gosh tanner scott's the guy i can't believe i'm doing this but tanner good luck in this bullpen i do have the set 295 overall tanner scott though but i don't i feel like that's cheating tell me in the comments below is that cheating Fin five i need something for oh god higher or lower i'm looking for an upgrade in the offense again just like jack peterson for this game of higher or lower we're gonna be going up until i end up losing and whatever guy i lose on is going to be the guy that we add to this team it'll make sense in a second just pay attention for this to doing whoever had the most home runs in their MLB career. And we got Mike Schmidt versus Vlad Guerrero straight off the bat. Vlad was a complete stud, but if we're talking home runs, Mike Schmidt easly. Come on. There we go. Had 548. My gosh, Mike Schmidt. Now we got Mike versus Hal. Well, I, I hope it's Mike because Hal's not in the game. So please, Mike, please. Easy. There we go. Now Craig Biggio versus Hal. Ooh, okay. Biggio really wasn't a home run hitter, but he still probably had more than Hal. So I'm going Biggio. And there we go. 291. All right, we're doing good. I feel so bad for Prince because his career got cut off, but he was hitting so many home runs. I just don't think it was enough. But then again, Prince Fiddler was known for power hitting. So if he doesn't have more than 300, I got problems. Prince, we're riding with you, dude. Yes. Wow. Father versus son. Are you kidding me? Ironically, I actually remember seeing a stat that they both finished with the exact same career home runs. So Pop should have 319. I'm still going with Prince, but Pop should have 319. And he does. So there we go. I'm so lucky that I just saw that stat randomly. Papa Fielder versus Greg. Honestly, I don't know who Greg is. I'm going with Pops real quick. Hold on, please. So close. Wow. Wow. Larry Walker is a Hall of Famer. He better have more. Come on, Larry. There we are. And now we got Gary Carter versus Dan Ugla. Are you si I'm going Gary. There's no way that Dan beat us. All right, yeah, 100%. Now we got Dan Ugla versus Jermaine Dive. Dan Ugla, I swear. No way, Jermaine. All right, sorry, bro. Looks like Dan Ugla is going to be our guy if he's even in MLB The Show. There is a 0% chance that Dan Ugla is in this game, and unfortunately, I'm right. I do know one guy that's in this game, though, and it's Prince Fielder. So, hey, I think we go with him. Prince Fielder is really the only one there in the last couple rounds that is in the game. So I think we got to go Prince. So Prince, there you are. We got our brand new first baseman, which I'm so happy about. And my God, do 
we need it. Look at the differences between our first baseman now and Prince Fielder. Pin number six, come on, jumbo pack. Are they even in the game anymore? I mean, technically they're not, but I could buy three diamond duos for 15,000. That is kind of a jumbo pack, I guess, because that is three packs in one. So I'm just going to go with that. And for this, we're getting pack 30. The diamond duo is 29 and pack 20. All right, not bad. I'm going to go with pack 30 at first. What do we got real quick? Silver, that's not great. Zach Nito. Now back to pack 20. We're going to end it on 29. I got to see a diamond here real quick. And there it is. Perfect. Who do we got, baby? It's purple. All right. So it's basically going to be nobody. That's what I know. Who do we got? Who's going to be our best guy right now? Kyle Tucker. Hey, I do like Kyle Tucker, even though it's the live series. But still, just in case we don't get anybody else, I'm adding Kyle Tucker as the right fielder. So Kyle Tucker, I need you to be on your A game right now. Last pack of the diamond duos, pack 29. Come on. If I can go back to back diamonds, that'd be absolutely insane. Dude, no freaking shot. There's two diamonds. Does that mean I hit big real quick? All right, hold on. That's a purple. The first player is the cover boy, which I'm happy about. But this one, I have to know. What do we got? Another purple. Okay. Can it just be two diamonds of any single type of like series? That makes me a little nervous. And we got Jonah Heim. Okay. So it definitely can be two live series. That's unfortunate. I'm still going Kyle Tucker and I'm just going to go ahead and sell the rest of the guys. Been seven almost halfway through and we got diamond duos again. There's no way. Luckily, I still have a diamond duos. It's just a random diamond duos pack. So what do we got? Which one am I getting? Pack 16. Okay. What does that have in it? We got Aroldis Chapman and G Money with, oh, one of my favorite jerseys of all time. I wouldn't mind a little bit of G Money though, real quick. Come on, diamond duos. That's... Don't tell me that's our diamond, please. No, no. Oh gosh, dude. I got what I was looking for. My favorite jersey. I'm definitely putting that on during this game. But yo, I think we got to go with John Birdie as our shortstop. <laughs> oh my God, that hurts. He's really not that big of an upgrade, but there we go. John Birdie. Spin a real quick random captain pick. That basically means I have to pick any of these captains real quick. So who do I got? I have a boatload of captains right now. And honestly, I'm thinking we go Eddie Rosario. His swing is so smooth in this game. So I got to go with him. Plus he's got 125, 125 on both the contacts and 125 clutch. Spin nine real quick. I need a little bit more help behind the dish and bronze in the bullpen. <laughs> what am I going to pick here to replace 99 Kenley? No matter what, it's terrible, but I think I might go bruised Dar. My boy's still got 100 miles an hour on that fastball, so I'm just going to go with them. <laughs> spin 10, and after this, we come down to our last five spins, which this team is still not ready. Jumbo pack again. All right, we're just going to go ahead and uh, yeah, let's respin that. There we go. What do we got, baby? Random silver. I should have done the jumbo pack. With the random silver, I'm going second base. I just have no idea who the heck I want. Estrada's definitely not bad with 93 contact versus left. Cattell Marte is always pretty good good. I think I might go Cattell Marte just because he's up to an 82 today. So Cattell, welcome to the squad. It's been 11 right now. We're coming down to it. And Twitter picks. Here we go. Real quick, if you guys haven't followed me, follow me on Twitter. Here we go. Real quick, give me a random diamond dicey player. Please be nice. Let's go ahead and post it. Oh gosh, what's up? Oh my gosh, we got a response. JJ Blade. That's not what I'm looking for, guys. Come on. Please tell me there's like a prospect JJ Blade or something, even though I've never seen it. 63 overall. This is why I don't ask Twitter for anything. All right, JJ, let's go, dude. Enjoy. Thank goodness I don't have to start him. He's going to be our number one bench warmer in my heart. Look at all the other good responses I got just after that. This is why you guys got to follow me and be on top of this stuff because I need your help. Been 11, 12. I honestly forgot. That's not good. And chase pack. Oh my gosh. I have to buy a 50 pack bundle. That's not exactly exciting. What is exciting though is I potentially have the chance to get 99 Ellie De La Cruz. And if I get him, we're doing another one of these videos with Ellie. So 75,000 down the drain. Give me my chase pack. Come on. Please show me the gold lights. That's all I care about. Gold. And it's purple again. I got to be the worst with chase packs in this game's history. It's actually disgusting as we got Shane, RIP, my boy. I mean, I'll definitely add him to the team, but we're still using Shohei, so he's probably not going to get used. Next spin up, here we go. Random set three player. That's a little bit better. And really, all I'm going to do is set the search filter to set three and then pick a random player. Since I don't want to cheat on this, we're going to pick a random page as well. So I literally just am going to have to look down. So three, two, and one, go. We got page three. That's not bad. Let's hope that we can get a catcher though real quick. So again, looking down, what freaking player is it going to be? Please do not be that bad. Three, two, one. <sighs> Jacob Wilson. Oh, okay. He's definitely not the worst. Dude, I was two off of Blake Mitchell. All right, Jacob, come on. Jacob, you're going to be going to third base, actually. So that works. I still desperately need a catcher, though. So I need one of these last couple spins to give me a good catcher as we have to discard a random player on this team. Oh, no. I don't care what anybody says, but Shohei is protected here. I'm just going to run through this a little bit so it's fully random. And then three two and one prince fielder no 
My sweet Prince, no. Quick sell Prince Fielder. I guess I have to. Prince, I'm so sorry. What the heck is our reroll gonna be? Come on, don't be that bad. And random set three player again. Okay, out of all the things in this wheel, we got that again. All right, well, hey, time to look down again. What page am I gonna be getting? In three, two, and one, we got page four. All right, still not the greatest, but I see two separate catchers right here. We got Kyle Teal and Adley. I could also be missing one, but still, let's hope that we get someone at the top and let's hope that we actually get a catcher. So come on, please, in three, two and one kevin gosman it could have been worse i could have got tom glavin and had to spend 159,000. so gosman uh yeah get over here dude uh welcome to the team even though we're not going to use you next spin wheel please be nice to me i need a catcher so whatever you do here we go snapchat ai pick yo this snapchat ai is so creepy but all right here we go hey give me a random mlb player I'll be nice please let's see what we got who's he gonna be giving me how about bryce harper he's a great player hey he is a great player thank you and sub to also our jess hit that subscribe button one of our last two spins and we still have a common catcher please superstar will oh my gosh here we go baby this one's for all the marbles please let it be good and please let it be a catcher whatever you guys do Jorge polanco that's not what i was hoping for at all actually the first thing i gotta do is actually go and get a bryce harper my guy's been playing a lot of first base and he has this insane card and this card can play first base so bryce harper get over here dude come on let's go i'm so excited for that and yo Jorge polanco please tell me you can catch a little bit please baby come on give me something and no he can't he's a really good card but i really don't want to buy him for thirty-two thousand. but i can get him for twenty-two thousand. so hopefully someone will sell me this card for 22 while i'm waiting on Jorge polanco we get one more spin and please let it just be like player of my choice or something prospect pick i'm down with that he's technically a prospect now and i get my blake mitchell card and we finally get a catcher that's really all i cared about thank goodness and luckily last second coming in clutch we ended up getting that Jorge polanco he's gonna be taking over at shortstop and now this thing was actually looking good i mean kyle tucker and Catal Marte, not the best but overall i like it i just need us to win this game so we don't have to discard another random player but first up eddie rosario here we go and we're in the nice unis too i love it all right eddie let's get a good pitch like that one so freaking close come on polanco 2-0 that's a terror what am i doing why are we getting rolled over this early all right big boy jock in his home stadium too run i need an absolute meatball like that that's off the end of the bat. I don't know if that's gonna have enough carry. Please, no. All right, Shohei on the mound. Let's have a great game, baby. Shohei on the mound making his debut. I worked so hard for this card, so I'm so happy to actually be doing this. Can tell Marte, get there, you bronze piece of garbage. Thank you. First out with player of the month, Shohei Otani. Let's go. Yo, he can hit 102 with his fastballs. We got him out here already, and I think you guys know. I gotta go Mike Trout, WBC versus Shohei Otani. So close. We got Sammy too. I need my first strikeout. I'm hitting with the Mike Trout special WBC, and we got him. First strikeout, Shohei Otani. Let's get it, baby. And that's a little comeback right up to Shohei. Beautiful job. And here he is. Look how good he looks in the Rays uniform, by the way. Please, Rays, just sign the guy. I know it's going to take your entire team's budget, but please. One, two, real quick on Otani. That's a terrible pitch. Two, two. The full count on Otani. I really don't want to walk for my first at bat with him. So we're going to do that instead, dude. Into the water. Go, go, go. Still, though, home run in our first at bat with player of the month, Shohei Otani. That's what I needed right there. Lefty on lefty, too. It didn't matter. That was my first swing with player of the month, Shohei Otani, too. It happened to be a bomb out to right field. All right, Blake Mitchell up now. Oh my gosh, another perfect, perfect. Go, everybody. Go, go, go. Yes. So he slammed on that ball. 106 going to 430. That's why I wanted Blake Mitchell right there. And after two home runs in the top of the second inning, we fell apart after that. But it's all good, though. We still got the 3 0 lead in the top of the second. I'm feeling good. Plus, with Otani being able to pump 102, I'm feeling great. Yo, boys, we got the 02 again. I got to do it and oh gosh okay why is kyle tucker gonna be the one to go get that hello center fielder do something that being Shohei otani's first hit is so stupid and blake mitchell you're taking forever dude get him there we go three two two outs i gotta go with the pitch i gotta do it and that's it beautiful come on get him get him jacob nice job Shohei. i gotta make ron pitch a little bit more i'm going after way too many first pitches there it is that's what i'm talking about polanco let that get down and it's not going anywhere okay home run derby jock back up here in his home stadium i need a bomb from him today let's go jock please that's 2-1 just at some point i need one today that might be no we dropped the pci just a little too far that would have been it too if we didn't drop it so far no way dude he actually dashboarded bro quit after three innings that's a huge w for me that means we don't have to discard anybody on this team if you guys want more videos like this be sure to hit that subscribe button and if you guys like this video i know for a fact you're gonna love this one